In 1950, I devoted my life to tea. I saw so much inequality around the world that even as a young man with nothing but a big dream, I decided that my dilemma would serve humanity. I wanted my passion to benefit my workers, marginalized people in the community and the environment. So I made my dilemma a business that is also a matter of human service. That commitment has so far generated $40 million in humanitarian aid and environmental intervention. Thousands of children, young women and men, impoverished adults, farmers, war widows have been touched by my foundation. Endangered species, degraded ecosystems, and agriculture have benefited by the work of Dilma Conservation, thus in conserving the environment, environmental education, climate adaptation, and advocacy. That makes me so very happy. Now, as I approach my 70th year in tea, I am changing my pledge. A minimum 10% of pre-tax profits from Dilma funded the work of the MGF Charitable Foundation and Dilma Conservation. This year, I am increasing that by 50%. Every business has an obligation to share its success with those in need and become part of the solution to inequality, global warming, and the multitude of threats that we face today. We are a small family business and we cannot do this alone, but we have to do more. I thank God, every customer, every member of my family, the Dilma team, and all those well-wishers and friends of Dilma for making my dream come true. Thank you for making every cup of Dilma a cup of kindness.